Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you for watching another marvelous video. That uh, we come to you, we're on the road where Travis Walton made his disappearance with the old uh, the UFOs, you know, the UAPs, the, the MAUs, the MAUs, if you want to call them that. Machine automated upwards, right? I don't. Okay. Anyway. Uh, remember, a careless match destroys. They've already had that happen here, so ladies and gentlemen, if you ever... Littering it is also unlawful. Beautiful. And uh, we're going to try to find the clearing at which this uh, happened. A lot of locals have said that uh, you can tell by the trees, the inside circle of where Mr. Travis was abducted, the trees have been irradiated just enough to make this reddish brown type bark it's pretty interesting I've watched another couple of channels uh, look down below and up in the other corner there and uh, we can put you to those links and make sure you subscribe and hit that like button because we're gonna bring more content your way not every day but as quick as we can long pause so not very much going on Another turn off there. That likely could be the spot. No, it's not the spot. <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend said probably not the spot, so we're gonna keep going forward. But okay, uh, we're heading into the forest now. Oh look. oh look, we got another. You guys like horses? Yep. Well, there's a horse and a baby horse. It's hard to move forward. The bush is in the way. The bush, honey. They got a baby horse. I think it's dying. Nope. See it on the ground there, guys? Oh Leak. Uh, he might be sick or he's taking a nap. Probably taking a nap. That's what we're going to go with. There's and then we got a little friend. His name's Toboggan. Uh, guys, I love you. You'd be nice to each other. Is he okay? He doesn't look like he's in distress. He doesn't? No, he's not breathing hard or anything. Is His ears he twitching. Here's yours. Come on. Okay. We can't bring this to our live viewers here. Okay. It's, not, it's not. We just live. want to say that he'll be all right. Okay, get him one more time. Hi, friend. Now. <laughs> I got a little weird there. He's seen this a lot, honey. Okay. On we go, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Humanoids of all kinds. What an adventure this has been. What a 4th of July weekend spending it with my honey. Take some uh, video out here. Well, let's go to this spot right here. Look at this. Look at this clearing. I think it was a pretty long drive back into town. I think they were back in the guts, you know what I mean? Back in them, their guts. It was a long drive back to Snowflake. No, when they, was it the Snowflake that they went? Yeah, yeah you're right. That's when they reported it. <clears throat> well, if we had more time, guys, we would we'd go over here to these, uh, <clears throat> these glampers and we'd be all up in their craw, you know, asking questions. Do they know where the site's at? I don't know. <laughs> did they did they go back to Snowflake the way we're going? Or did they come People out? People camp to... in the place where they don't even know it. People camp out here. This looks familiar. Check that out. Another glamper? Yep. Uh, both Linda and I urge you to, uh, first of all, read all the literature you possibly can on uh, Travis Walton's abduction. And of course, you know, you're going to want to get in there and hook your teeth into the movie called Fire in the Sky and 
<clears throat> I'm promoting it because it's great. It uh, tales a little uh, different than the uh, all the literature that we've read, but still, grab your popcorn, maybe a beer or two. Get your ladies' feet in your hands, fellas. Just do it and rub them down, make her go to sleep, and watch the show with her because she'll love it. And everything will be great in your world. Okay, here's the rim. We're coming up to the rim. What do you mean? The forest seems to be getting thicker and as light dwanes in the background, dwanes, is that right? <laughs> yeah, dwanes yeah, in the background. Sometimes guys, I just make up stuff and it sounds good, but it's really not what it means and well, either you like it or you hate it and you can do both, that's fine. But as the light dwanes, anyways, uh, you know, it's getting a little crisp out here. I'm in shorts and flip-flops, probably shouldn't be. We got a couple of hoodies, so we'll be all right. And we've got a more than capable RAV4 grocery getter that's hitting these back trails like just a champ, you know, the all-wheel drive version, the, the custom deluxe, as you might say, the XLT. Is your engine light on? No, it's not. Sorry, she's in EcoBoost mode. Sorry, she about had a heart attack there. You're uh, you're getting on it. We don't have much light. This gonna take us to Snowflake? No. No. This takes you down to Black Hill. What? Balls. You see Bigfoot? I'm sorry. Whoa! That's an antelope. There might be more. Usually they run in herds or packs. There they are. Damn it. And there you go ran away. Well, that's neat. See some wildlife. I didn't realize how white their butts are. I think those are white-tailed deer. No, their their horns were different. I didn't see any horns. They're youngsters. Boy, they sure can disappear, huh? Horns. Just like the UFO that abducted <laughs> Travis Dalton. Walton. Walton. We need to get one of those stabilizer things, you know what I mean? Because we're hitting bumps like this. Oh, and the viewer, the viewer is getting you. sick. Just kidding. You are a human shock absorber. I'm trying my best. Okay. All right. This is, it could be anywhere over here. Could be really. anywhere, yeah. So it's pretty much, it was described as a clearing and they had just finished up work for the day and they were loading up into their truck. So it would be probably anywhere off to the side where there's like a side road and clearing. That's the rim. As he stares in awe up at the ship, purple lights and white, shiny, shimmering sprinkles of what he thought was very large pieces of glitter. Some type of metallic substance unknown to man, but known to aliens. Okay. Yeah. 
you know, when I was making my uh, story about uh, Rusty and Sharon's abduction, not very far from here, as a matter of fact, probably about 20 minutes away from here, uh, this, is what I, this is what I saw in my mind's eye. And if you go to most abstract of all creatures, you can uh, read that story. You can know all about it. 